to part two of the comeback of the Accord. Told you these daily uploads are coming at you guys. Stay tuned for them and keep smashing that like button. And hit the notification button. Keep on subscribing. Alright guys, what we're going to do right now, we're going to pull the wheels off the car. Pull the spacers off. Take the brakes off. <clears throat> we're going to take the rotors up to O'Reilly so we can get them turned. We're going to slide some brake pads on this thing. And probably tackle the tie rods as well. So let's get these wheels off. Get these rotors off. So we can get some new ones on the front. You know On to the next side. All right, this side is off. While I have this off, I'm gonna go ahead and replace this stud. So we're gonna go up to O'Reilly's and pick up a new one. Yeah, so everything is off. Let's go to O'Reilly's and get pads, the wheel stud, and get those. And we're gonna turn those rotors. All right, we got some cleaner pads, and I just bought two rotors. They were real cheap, so. We'll just put new ones on there instead. Let's head to the house and clean up some things. Shit. I forgot a wheel stud. Be right back. Got the wheel stud. Let's head back to the house and work on this car. Alright guys, we're going to start first with putting the wheel stud in. Pretty simple. Just find a spot where you can get it all the way in. Ha! Let's put some rotors on it. Done. Move to the driver's side.
hope I'm in France. I know, I put a set on there, and I'm this, but I don't have a lug nut for it. I know, don't roast me guys. We'll address that too, soon. We still gotta do the tie rods, but I'm not gonna do it in this video because it's about to get dark. But progress, progress, that's what we're looking at. We got progress, we got brakes on it now. I'll tear it back apart and do the tie rods on it. Um, I got a um, camera kit coming in for it. Um, I had true heart camera kits, guys. And when I moved out of the old house, I left it in the attic. I have fronts and rears, and I left it in the attic of the old house. When those come in, we'll do that. But we'll address the tie rods probably in the next video and some other bushings. So brakes are done, and it's a video, and it's progress on the car. So we'll get this wheel on. And I ordered new lug nuts for the car. So when they come in, they'll go on. bit of dirty work on the Accord done. I know it wasn't a lot that we got done, but we got the wheel stud that's been broken on there, um, and new brakes. We got pads and rotors on there, ceramic brake pads, so they're good pads, and then some rotors. I was going to replace the calipers, but there's nothing wrong with these calipers, and I actually replaced those calipers a couple years ago, so they're still good. If they go bad, I'll get new ones. But I haven't had an issue with those. I didn't have an issue with the brakes squeak. They squeaked a little bit and they just threw a lot of brake dust on the tires or the rims. So I decided to replace pads and rotors on the front. I was going to turn the rotors, but they were just too bad. So we threw new ones on there because why not? They're cheap. And we're bringing the cord back. We're trying to make it look good, sound good, run good, feel good, stop good. Like we're just going to go hard on this car, you know? Make everything look great again. So, and I'm not gonna be like other people, oh, make my car great again, make blah, blah, blah great again. No, it's still a, a daily driver, it's still gonna be this. We're just gonna make it look better, sound better, run better, and everything where it's comfortable daily and more reliable. Because this car ain't that reliable, to be honest. <laughs> I mean, the motor's good, it's just the stupid little shit that makes it, you know, not reliable, I guess, like the leaks and stuff. Just not, not reliable, just annoying, you know? We're going to get the body work done on that. But wheel studs going to come in. I ordered those actually last night. So we're going to have new wheel studs all around on it. And order something else. I don't remember. Ordered a couple things. So, But parts are coming. 
big parts, small parts, little things, but it's all progress on the Accord. So that's going to do it for this one, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share. Hit the notification button so you guys get notified when I post because we're going to be daily posting. I don't know for how long, but I would like to daily post for the next week if possible. So just some days I get out of work early, some days I get out at night. So bear with me. I'm going to try and post as much as I can because I'm going to do a lot of work on this. <clears throat> we're also going to be pulling the whole front end off the car eventually. The hood, and, well maybe not the hood, but like the fenders and lights and stuff. And I want to paint that part of the frame. You know, and then if I ever do pull the motor out, we'll paint engine bay, but we'll work on the outside of it first. Clean things up, make it look good. So, yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.